Really shifting into another gear here tonight. All right, well, new at six. Well, we certainly count on our hospitals to be a place of good health and healing. But 13 Chief Investigator Darcy Spears discovered a lapse in cleanliness at one local hospital that has one patient worried about everyone else there. The hospital is one of the last places any of us wants to be right now, but for some it's unavoidable. A man who found himself here at Sunrise Hospital last week after a car accident checked out a day early because he felt unsafe and it had nothing to do with coronavirus. On March 11th, Mario Villanueva was stopped on the Sahara off ramp of the I-15 freeway when he was slammed from behind by another driver. He had his phone in his hand or, you know, he was distracted and and uh, didn't see that traffic was at a complete stop. So he just came behind me, rear-ended me, and uh, tossed me enough to T-bone me again. Causing swelling in Mario's spine that left him hospitalized for several days, but he left before he was supposed to. When the food happened was when I decided, hey, even though I wasn't okay to leave home. Hospital food has long been the butt of jokes, but this is no laughing matter. Well, a few hours later, when dinner came in, <laughs> there was bugs in my in my in my food. He didn't realize it until after he'd already eaten some of his dinner. He took this video and says it proves his point. They they came in and uh, they joked around about it, which I didn't think was a joking matter. You they know, joked about the fact that they served you hospital food with bugs crawling on it. Yes, they did. They said that I could be a contestant for fear factor. I, mean, I didn't think it was funny at all. The hospital eventually created this incident report after Mario repeatedly raised alarm bells. Uh, it was until I showed them the video and that they said, oh, there's a video. I said, yes, I have a video because I knew for a fact you were going to take a picture. And that's when they made the report. He says hospital staff apologized and said they were embarrassed about the situation, but offered no assurance that they'd inspect or deep clean the kitchen to root out the source of the bugs. I was upset. I really was. I was more than upset. You don't know what a bug contains. You know, it could be carrying a, a disease for all I know. When 13 Investigates asked Sunrise for comment, they sent this statement saying the health and safety of our patients and families is always our top priority at Sunrise. If a patient brings to our attention a quality issue or concern, we're diligent in our efforts to address and seek resolution with them. Due to federal HIPAA guidelines, we cannot discuss patients or protected health information. They're not violating any HIPAA law um, because they're not speaking about my my health or anything. They, they were supposed to speak about what was going on in the kitchen, and I don't believe there's patients in the kitchen. We told Sunrise Hospital the same thing, that we didn't see how HIPAA applied to bugs in a hospital cafeteria. And even after Mario agreed to waive his HIPAA privacy protections, Sunrise still declined to comment further. The State Department of Health is now investigating. Darcy Spears, 13 Investigates.